Please, please, one at a time. My daughter's school is falling apart and there's just not enough teachers to cope. My mother needs surgery and she's been waiting six months. I got made redundant and can't pay my rent, but there are no council houses. Look, I know you're all angry, but there is one simple explanation. It's all his fault. Huh? What's Sally got to do with my mother? Well, he's an immigrant. If we get rid of Ali, then medical waiting times will be shorter because we'll have more doctors. Actually, I, I am a doctor. But what about the services you've cut? Our schools? His fault. Housing? His fault. Hospitals? Look, whatever the problem is, it's because we don't have enough money. And we don't have enough money because we have to spend it all on Ali. About the money you've just given to that guy? He's just the CEO of a major tech company that needed a tax break. Don't worry about him. But if you need money, couldn't you just stop giving it to him? He clearly doesn't need it. You'd start giving it to schools and hospitals instead. Sorry. He's a job creator. He hasn't created any jobs around here. He isn't part of our community. Why would he care about us? I trust Sally more than him. Look, let me level with you. I would love to put more money into housing and healthcare and education, but my hands are tied. I have to give wealthy corporations massive tax cuts because... Because of Ali. Really? 